Hi, Sierra from the Elmore Library. Um, it's been a long time, so if you forgot who I am, I, I made sure to wear my name tag today. And this little pin that says, books make me happy. I hope to make you happy. But that's not what we're here for. Today, um, we're going to be painting rocks. So I'm going to show you a little bit of the layout I have sitting here in front of me. I have six rocks that are about the size of my hand, fit right in my palm, and those are going to be petals. And then the one in the center is going to be the center for our flower. So a couple of tips. Um, I use patio paint. It is my favorite kind of paint because it is indoor-outdoor. It works great for if you're painting for something we're outside, which is what this will eventually be. It will go outside. So I would encourage you to use patio paint. It is acrylic. Um, most craft paints are acrylic, so if that's what you have at home, that works just as fine. Um, at the end, I would suggest glazing it. I have a high gloss brush on glaze. You can do that when it's dry or if you have um, Krylon spray, which is just like a spray paint can, just a clear glaze. That works fine too. Um, I had another tip and now I can't think of it. So, let's get started. after I glaze it. Here's what we want you to do. We want you to paint some of these flower rocks. They don't have to look like this. They don't have to look like mine. They can be whatever color you want. But we want you to paint these for the library flower beds that we can display this summer. How cool is that, right? All right. Thanks for watching. I'll probably do more of these. Um, at a later date, not sure yet, but we miss you all. Thanks for watching. <laughs>